most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living in return with having. When people feel that they have rights to someone else's radio cast, they violate the law. They edit something that doesn't belong to them at all. They interfere with their life. They gang up in a group and they just think they're going to teach a lesson of God. Really? You're a coward and you're going to teach a lesson of God. You see, a coward stands in the shadows. A coward attacks someone when they're asleep. A coward cuts a man's beard without his consent or permission, thinking, I'll just clean him up because it's my job to do this to God's house. No, it's not. What you just did was sexually assault someone. It is a sexual assault of any person who has a beard when you cut the hair off their body or the hair off their face. That is a sexual assault. A sexual assault victim can talk to people about the sexual assault, but if it's a man, nobody wants to listen. They just want to say, oh, well, we're just cleaning them up and we have the right to do that because we're the fucking religious right. No, you're not. You're an immoral man who has a wife allowing you to sexually assault someone because of your version of God's world. Your version of God's world is clearly not God's world. And how I prove that is that God is still cleaning up the whole fucking world with COVID. He's also cleaning house in your house because you failed to do your house, didn't you? You failed to get married. You failed to find a husband. You find, failed to find love. You failed your life. And your failure in your life was not interfering with someone's life. Your failure of your life was trying to interfere in a life. And when you in, engaged all your siblings to destroy a man's records, to lie, to steal, to cheat, you failed the Lord. You became a child of Satan. And Satan is the lowest level of God. So let's be clear. When you put your hands on someone in the night without their lawful consent, you sexually assaulted them. You sexually trafficked them. You sexually burdened them. And you literally immorally impeded your whole fucking right to heaven. You are a coward, you motherfucker. That you thought you'd keep cutting a man's beard even when he's moved away from your fucking faggot hands. You're a motherfucking faggot man who cannot stop himself, who cannot help himself, who just thought he'd sexually assault someone in jail and keep doing it outside of jail because he just thought he'd fucking do it. Well, let me tell you, I am coming for you. I am gunning for you. And the minute God releases me to find you, I will find you and I will make sure you pay. You will be paying millions of dollars on behalf of your organization. Millions of dollars. Because you had no fucking right to my medical records. You had no fucking right to my privacy records. You had no fucking right to touch me at all. And you motherfuckers are immoral. You are so immoral that we are going to defund the fucking police. We're going to make sure every fucking one of you dies. And we don't give a shit about you because all you do is lie.